not only a pretty easy question for me, but it's also super fun this year. So you can see this is my Christmas tree. It's been in the other videos. We just put this up this weekend and it's got, as most people's trees do, lots of um, very personal ornaments, a lot of ornaments from where we've traveled. But the ones that I wanted to talk with you about on this video are these two particular ornaments. And my latest book is called A Love to Last. And the premise of the story is what if a pair of custom cowboy boots could not only tell you what you were destined to do in life, but who you were destined to fall in love with, who your true soulmate is. So I don't know, um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna come in here a little bit to the camera. These are actually two uh, miniature cowboy boot ornaments and it may be hard to tell sorry I have to put my glasses up so I can see this is actually inlay here on this boot and then this is actual stitching here and um, so none of this is um, is fake basically this was actually done by Lisa Sorrell who is the boot maker who helped me with all of the research on A Love to Last. She answered lots of questions about custom boot making. She is a custom boot maker and she operates in Guthrie, Oklahoma. And she also has an amazing series of YouTube videos that really helped me get many of my details right. But these, um, these particular ornaments I bought in her shop several years ago and they're just really prized ornaments. I smile every year when I get them out. So. Um, these are definitely the ornaments that Cal and Delaney and I love to last would have on their tree. Little girl, we had these, um, gosh, I don't know, they're whoop, like cylindrical, kind of diamond-y shaped, I don't know, what would you call that, Mom? Anyway, they were really pretty turquoise and they were long and they kind of got fat in the middle and then there were four in the box, I remember it so clearly, and I used to love putting those on the tree, they were my very favorite. And now that I think of it, that turquoise was pretty um, forward thinking because that's really hot right now. Of course, they looked super on our silver tree with the light that went <laughs> with all the colors on it. <laughs> Oh, but I did get a couple new ornaments already this year. Stack of books, because, you know, got a writer girl has to have books. And then everybody that knows me knows I'm crazy for turquoise. We have this beautiful snowflake with turquoise tips in it. I'm excited to be able to hang both of these this year. So much fun.